televisions have just been forwarded to the best newscast that you will ever see. PCN News! Hi, I'm And I'm Dick. Here's what's going on in the world. In Virginia, a three-year-old little boy wandered off into the woods two days ago in quite cold weather. It's no doubt he would have frozen to death had it not been for the two little puppies that he had there with him. These very soft, cute, adorable, darling little puppies slept next to him and kept him warm all night until he was found the next morning. That's touching, Dick. It certainly is. Well, in other news, researchers say they have found the oldest marijuana stash in history. The stash was found in a tomb in a remote part of China and is approximately 2,700 years old. The 800 grams of this is enough proof to show that man has been using cannabis and will continue to use cannabis for its healing powers for years and years to come. But cannabis is illegal. That is right. It certainly is, Dick. Right. Well, let's just THC what we have up next for you guys. Hi, this is Ben Slade with uh, Ian Wilson from the Varsity Poway hockey team. Uh, how are you doing, Ian, with your victory against RB? Uh, it feels great. Um, I knew we were going to win, so it wasn't that big of a deal. Uh, I'm here with uh, Zach Backris. This is Ben Slade with the uh, PCN News. Uh, Zach, how do you feel about your win against RB? Well, a win is an under understatement because uh, I like to look at it as a slaughter fest. I hate winning, but I never lost, so I don't know how it feels. Uh, I lead the team to victory every game. I'm the reason we win. So I'd like to throw that out there. Thank you very much. Jennifer Aniston is fed up. Starring actress of the upcoming yes, movie, Marley and Me, is sick of all the rumors that are being spread around her. Internet, newspapers, magazines. She's had enough, especially about her being pregnant. She says people need to stop worrying about her and just do other things. Yeah, no one really cares about her anyways, so. What's next? You are right. So now we're going to go down to our good friend Colby, who's going to give us some news about upcoming concerts. To you, Cubs. Hey, guys, I'm Colby, and I got some concerts for you coming up in San Diego. First off, we got the hip hop legends Wu Tang Clan on December 5th at the House of Blues. Then coming up, we got the punk guys Rancid coming December 6th at Soma. And December 8th at the House of Blues, we got the All American Rejects coming out. December 15th, we have the metal legends Metallica. That'll be at the Cox Arena. December 19th, we got Stick to Your Guns at Soma. On December 12th at the House of Blues is Helmet with Fu Manchu. Back to you guys. That is some compelling information about those concerts. I might be attending one of those this weekend. Uh, up next, we're gonna be talking to Maxi about addressing the mess. What inspired me to start the Address the Mess uh, movement. Quite honestly, most people don't know that Address the Mess didn't actually come from me. It was started by a geoscience teacher who no longer works here. I hope Address the Mess becomes something like a, a truth campaign, you know, like don't smoke, it's bad for you. Say no to drugs, the D.A.R.E. campaign. I know if they see me and there's some trash around them, they're very quick to pick it up when normally they may not have done that two, three years ago when campus was atrocious after lunchtime. If I could give one piece of advice to Poway High students, it would be just like, you know, take, take pride in your campus. This is yours. You will say you graduated from Poway High School. What are the things that you remember about it? This is kind of uh, your legacy. Pride, how much pride did you have in your campus? Have some pride, Poway. Thanks, Maxie. <laughs> Next up, we have our surf report. What's up? This is PCN Newscast. Here with the surf forecast for the week. As you can see today, not too shabby, a little big, a little mushy. But uh, there should be a fat swell rolling in a few days. It's going to be pretty good. About six footers next Wednesday, so surf's up. Uh, November 22nd, you know, we all got up like 5.30 in the morning, head out. Heard it's supposed to be offshore. We head out to 15th Street. It's pretty good. It has some nice size on it. Then we headed up to D Street. Got down to Fletcher's, and that's where we pretty much cut it off and just got flat. It was a pretty good day though, you know? Pretty stoked on it, got some good waves. Back to you guys in the PCN newsroom. Shut up, shred it bro. That's some radical stuff, my friend. From all of us at PCN News, have a nice holiday. Remember, we love you here at PCN News, and we're not afraid to let you know that.